Make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to stay updated. Welcome to Mastering the Boomi Interview, Technical Questions Part 7, The Ultimate Guide to Conquering Advanced Technical Questions in Boomi Interviews. Building upon the foundation established in Part 6, this video is designed to equip you with advanced strategies and expert insights that will set you apart from other candidates and impress interviewers. Question. Have you used cross-reference table? What is the use of cross-reference table? Answer. A cross-reference table in Boomi is used to map values between different systems or data formats during integration. It facilitates data transformation and alignment by establishing relationships and translations between source and target values. The cross-reference table in Boomi typically consists of two main columns, the source column and the target column. The source column represents the values or codes from the source system or data, while the target column represents the corresponding values or codes in the target system or data. Question. What is map function? Can it be used in business rule shape? Answer. In Boomi, the map function is a built-in feature of the data mapping component within a process. It allows you to transform and map data between different source and target structures using a visual drag-and-drop interface. The map function simplifies the process of data transformation and alignment during integration, enabling you to define mappings between fields, perform calculations, apply conditional logic, and manipulate data formats. It is mainly used inside the map but it can be used in business rule shape also. Question. Explain the deployment process in Boomi. How will you make sure environment parameters are configurable? Answer. In Boomi, the deployment process refers to the steps and actions involved in releasing and executing integration processes in different environments. It includes tasks such as building, packaging, and deploying integration solutions from development to production environments. Boomi provides features for environment management, deployment packages, versioning, rollback, and monitoring to ensure efficient and reliable deployments of integration processes. Extensions can be used to make parameters configurable in different environments. Question. Is it necessary to deploy the sub-process when the main process is deployed? Answer. No. It is not required as sub-process will be deployed with main process. Question. What methods do you use to monitor the execution of your process to ensure it is functioning correctly after deployment? Answer. Process reporting is a page in Boomi to monitor all the executions. Process reporting in Boomi involves monitoring, tracking, and analyzing the execution and performance of integration processes. It includes features such as real-time dashboards, execution logs, error reporting, process analytics, notifications slash alerts, and historical data. Process reporting provides visibility into process execution, helps identify issues, and enables data-driven decision-making for process optimization. In this video, we covered some common Boomi interview questions and provided expert answers to help you prepare effectively. Remember, practice and solid understanding of Boomi's key concepts, components, and best practices are essential for success. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to stay updated. Good luck!